Welcome back to Andis Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to create a calendar in SharePoint. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in SharePoint, just click on the following options. And from there, you're good to go. Creating a calendar in SharePoint allows you to schedule events, meetings, and deadlines within your team or organization. Now, for you to be able to add a calendar, all you got to do is go to the pages that you are currently working with. And you see the uh, new button here. Click on the app. All right. Just wait for it to load because what will happen is SharePoint provides a flexible and collaborative environment for managing calend calendars. Now in the apps, all you're going to do is uh, look for the calendar. You see this one? Or if you, find, you can find it here, just search by app name or publisher. I'm going to type in calendar. And hit enter. Now you see... All I'm going to do is choose this one. And of course, you can click on request if you don't have the admin access for it. All right. After that, what will happen is in the site contents page, click the new and then select app. And you might have an option to add an app directly from the left navigation menu, depending on your SharePoint configuration. As you can see, I don't have the admin access, but I'm going to ask my client that you give me uh, the authorization and permission and i could easily uh, click on calendar to add a new calendar to my site that's going to be it and just after that just enter the name of your calendar in the provided field this name will display as the title of your calendar all right now once you click the uh, create button to create the calendar sharepoint will create the calendar and add it to your site now you can access the calendar from the site contents page or on the left navigation menu. You can customize the calendar by adding events, adjusting views, setting permissions, and configuring additional settings as needed. All right. It's a very straightforward process. And when you follow all of these steps, you can easily create and manage a calendar in SharePoint, enhancing collaboration and organization within your team or um, your company because as you all know SharePoint allows you to create custom views of your calendar such as day week month or custom views based on filters or categories manage permissions to control who can view edit or manage events in the calendar thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video